Hello, we're at Linlithgow Palace here in, uh, in Scotland, in East of Scotland, not far from Edinburgh. And this place is the birthplace of Mary Queen of Scots. Um, with this magnificent statue, she was born here in 1542. Uh, it says there, Mary Queen of Scots, 1542 to 1587. And here she is, standing, looking at her own birthplace. The palace was built um, in the 1400s by King James I, and um, it was his pleasure palace. Um, he would get away from the get away from the affairs of state, uh, the pressures of running a country, and he would come here to this magnificent loch and his palace. Um, that he built or improved and um, added to in the uh, in the 1400s, and um, the kings and queens of Scotland would use this uh, to get away from Edinburgh for a couple hundred years until it uh, until there was a huge fire. Um, yeah, and it's a magnificent place. That is uh, St Michael's Church with the very impressive modern aluminium spire on top. Um, yeah, so this is in the uh, in the care of Historic Scotland, which is the government body that looks after uh, looks after historic places, castles and abbeys and uh, hill forts and that kind of thing in Scotland. And shall we just have a little walk around the other side? Because it's an impressive place. You can get in and wander around the palace and imagine that you're James the Fourth or James the Fifth or Mary and you are hosting a banquet perhaps four or five hundred years ago all of your uh, all of your friends all of the lords and ladies and dukes and ambassadors from foreign countries they would all be coming here um, I'll be coming here to uh, say hello to you. Look, there's some lovely little snowdrops there. Because it's February. And like I said, you can come here and go inside. There's a small entrance fee. A small fee to get in, but it's well worth it. You get into the, the Great Hall and uh, you go and see the, the fantastic fountain. Uh, which is in the, the great courtyard. Definitely worth it. And you can go for a wander around the loch if you like. And this is the old entrance here uh, on the uh, on the western, uh, oh, sorry, on the uh, the eastern wall. Just carefully going down the steps. Yeah, so that's where the king would enter the palace there. And you can see a magnificent coat of arms and crown above the door. And it really is quite spectacular. I'm sure you'll agree. I'll walk off this way a little bit. A really amazing place. There, that'll do. Thanks for watching. Make sure you subscribe to me to see other fantastic, magnificent places in Scotland as well.